cock our ear, we say. We lift one ear up, usually our best ear, <laughs> to strain to hear what it was that the person, other person heard. And in exactly the same way, we need to cock our ear and listen for the voice of God. It's, it's so close that, you know, you almost think you're listening with your natural ear, but it's not. You're listening with the ear of the Spirit. Okay, you're reaching out and saying, what did you say, God? See, I even put my hand to my ear. What did you say, God? And he speaks to us in that way. Seeing spiritually, when endeavouring to receive information from God, if you desire to see visually into the spirit realm, use the same faculties that you would when you look into your imagination. As you look at the screen of your imagination, ask yourself questions like, what is it that I'm seeing? What is it that I'm seeing? What is the picture that I'm seeing? Is that a man standing there? What is he doing? Where is he? Who is that person? How is he interacting with his environment? What do I feel about that person, etc.? These are just some sample questions. Let me say to you, when you're interpreting dreams, you use the same process. Your, your visual dream and you need to process it in the same way. Okay, you need to uh, come to that examining it, not just trying to sort of see the dream as one big thing. Ask questions about the various items that you see in your dream. When you have a dream, write it down because once you've written it down, you'll be able to remember it in the morning. <laughs> I had a friend uh, who wrote down, I was staying overnight and I talked about dreams and uh, he had a dream the following uh, that night and he wrote down all the individual things on an envelope that was lying beside his bed. And then in the morning when he woke up, he said, I had a dream last night after you spoke about dreams. And uh, he, he brought out the envelope and he said, oh, some of the things on these things on, that I've written here, I've forgotten. But now that I re, uh, I'm reading them, I, it's bringing it back to my recall. Okay? So we need to be systematic in the way we go about understanding the things that God is showing us. 